Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, dude and dudettes worldwide, yes, I'm talking to you. You right there behind that screen. You pretty little thing, even though you're probably a dude, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hold off on that compliment right now. But I know a couple chicks are watching. Anyways, what is up and what is good, YouTube, the World Wide Web, as you guys can see in full live HD. It is your host with the most, Paul Cantu, back at you guys with a brand new video. So essentially, this is my hey, I'm moving back to Texas video. But no, seriously, I am definitely moving back to Texas. And in doing so, I wanna make sure that I clear out a bunch of items that I have, clothing items in particular. That way my van has some freed up space to store all of my electronics and all the shit that I bought here. So basically, I am selling a bunch of Grail items from my personal collection, all of which will be for sale on hfv.bigcartel.com. That is my vintage website for everybody who has been asking me about it. But basically the first item we have up today is in the Neon Cheeto colorway. It is a quilted Tommy Hilfiger hunting jacket, AKA don't get shot by your friends or compadres in the forest jacket right here. This is a Bambi assassinator. This is a size large. And again, everything I'm showing off will be for sale today. So just check the site or follow the Instagram to stay up to date. This next piece is of course a Fuck Applebee's exclusive right here. It is this Chili's Firelicious, Fuego Licked, Sauce Dipped, Salsa Looking, and Chili All Embroidered Trill Frill Jacket with the shoulder pads. I got this at the Goodwill Bins. I just gotta put this on real quick. You know, I took some pictures from my IG with this on. You guys don't follow my personal IG, do that, cause it's fucking popping. But yeah, this jacket definitely is more flamboyant. It's for a particular buyer, that's for sure. But this piece is just so damn dope and vintage and custom homemade that I had to go ahead and cop that chili pepper flagger. Now the next piece we have up is another barn burner right here. This one definitely is a grailer. It is this vintage Chicago Bulls starter pinstripe jacket right here. It has the Clifford red sleeves, the black and white contrast pinstripes, starter all embroidered in that cocaine lettering, and then Bulls embroidered on the back. This is size XL. It even got the elbow patches in case you guys are trying to look like a swagged out librarian or some shit. But this is a very, very fucking sick piece. And of course, these go for a lot online. So on HIV, you guys most assuredly will be getting a deal because this is a fire ass grayler. Now you guys see me rocking the leprechaun green. The next clean green jersey we have going on right here is a vintage Umbro FAI. I guess that's the fucking, I don't even know, man. Irish Football Association. Boom, just, they rearrange the lettuce. But still, this is just a dope ass piece. It is the color of the leprechaun. Some lucky charm shit going on right here. But it definitely is a very rare Umbro piece. And I love finding these super old school soccer jerseys. They add a lot of pop to your outfits. And I actually have a lot of homies who love just rocking these casually and don't know shit about soccer. So if you guys do know something about soccer or not, either way, just a dope ass jersey. All right, guys, so sticking with the old school theme as are pretty much all these pieces we have a very sick vintage north face now i love these og north faces just because they're a bit more classy and sassy they just look like they're out of the 50s or some shit they have all chrome the north face buttons it has double zippers from the bottom and top which is sick on an old piece such as this and this thing will most assuredly keep you warm you guys already know the north face is high quality tie, and finding a super old school piece like this is very rare now next up we got some let me dig in the back of the reefer. We have this tie-dye fly guy, Aquaberry, Nymph in the Forest, getting strummed with a banjo by this weird gnome in the Mushroom Garden Enchanted Forest. So this definitely is a piece for anyone who experiments with LSD, some weed, some shrooms, any drugs you guys can imagine. This definitely is the piece, or if you just love tie-dye shit and see-through looking Tinkerbell nymphs, this is for you. Get your little fairy tale courtesan game up. That's fire. Moving on, we got some more Grailers. This piece in particular is a flamer. You have this old school Tommy Hilfiger blue fleece vest with a red interior. It has a big ass red pull tabs. It got a huge Tommy flag all embroidered on the tit. It could stop a bullet. It has a zipper pocket. Actually, it has four zipper pockets to be exact. And then on the back, it says Tommy Hilfiger right there. This definitely was a sick piece. I really wanted to keep this, but it's too big for your boy and I just need to get rid of shit. So if you guys would like to grab this, Again, it's gonna be for sale today. And now we got some Fuegolicious Fubu. So it's a Fubu Friday every Friday around these parts. And you have the beautiful nacho cheese against the navy blue 
FUBU League 05. I again wanted to keep this piece but just haven't had time to work it into my wardrobe. It has patches on the sleeves, all embroidered, a script right there, and then it just has the old school FUBU Sport logo embroidered on the other sleeve with all these little patches on the bottom of that ass right here on the back of that shirt. We got two pairs of short shorts as well. These are some flamers, 90s as hell, match with a lot of things. Fresh Prince of Bel Air status. And then we have some super sick green champion running shorts. Now these are super dope. Not only are they vintage, they got a zipper pocket on the back to hold all your narcotics or your money or your wallet or your iPhone, whatever you guys can imagine. And then it also has a very cool blue and white candy cane drawstring and then a huge embroidered patch on the left thigh right there. So then sticking with that, you know, a little tropical short short-esque type of theme, we got a beautiful extended tropical fruit encrusted Hawaiian shirt right here. So you guys can definitely get all of your vitamins and minerals from this piece. It is very dope. All right, so then last but certainly not least in regards to the apparel, I am selling my very rare NBA all embroidered patch jacket. Actually, I don't even fucking know if I'm gonna sell this. Damn, this piece is like, fuck. I don't know. I'm gonna think about this one because Jesus. Wow. Now moving on to the snapbacks. We have five of them that are going to be up for sale today. Excuse me while I disappear and almost bust my ass. We have the pig ass snapback. So this is an old school trucker little snap right here with a pig's ass coming out the crown. Very fucking rare if you guys want to give anyone that ham the booty then there's your option. The next piece we got up is some uh, Tony the Tiger of Frosted Flake Flame right here. It's just a very sick, a curved brim, little uh, Velcro back, little strap in the tiger print colorway thing. And then you also got stripes like a bangle. All right, then you also have this very sick Starbucks coffee curve rim right here. It says volunteer on the back and it says make your mark all embroidered. You know, I don't know if you guys want to look like a Starbucks employee, but I'm sure some people want to rock Starbucks ironically, so you will have the ability to do so. And then I got two vintage snapback grailers. Grail season. I have the Denver Broncos all embroidered snap right here. Old school as fuck. I think this hat is actually out the 80s. This shit looks super damn old. All embroidered, a fucking old logo on deck, clean ass hat. And then last but certainly not least, we have the LA Lakers pink all embroidered vintage snapback. Now I got this in Chinatown. The uh, little gift shop, little store worker said they used to own a sports shop back in the 90s and they had all this old school apparel and then it has a brand new tag on deck. So this is dead stock, cardboard still in it in a very dope relevant colorway and it's repping the Lakers with heavy embroidery. You already know, HAD actually is an OG cap, holds it down for the city. So basically all these items are going to be for sale on HFV.BigCartel. Again, I just want to go ahead and drop a video showing off vintage clothes because that is my passion on this wonderful ass Friday. If you guys would like to grab any of the items, again, the link to my vintage store will be down below. Also, follow the IG to stay up to date on when items release just because I don't always drop videos highlighting what I got going on the site. But thank you guys again for watching. Live the dream, eat vegan ice cream. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna be hitting it with a bunch of new videos and I cannot wait to get rid of all this shit and take my ass back down to the South. Peace. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life by rooster. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to. You should get used to. You should get used to.